The 8th grade technology education program explores methods of problem solving. This requires students to outline a problem or challenge and formulate a strategy to solve it through a process of writing, sketching, design, and group cooperation. Students begin a design challenge by researching relevant information through web searches, text sources, and videos. They outline possible solutions individually and then compare their ideas with their group and decide on an initial strategy. The fun and learning continues with the implementation of their ideas. Building and testing are, are an important part of the engineering process. Students test their devices and note any design flaws. They then develop ideas to improve their designs and the process repeats numerous times, getting them closer and closer to their goal. To introduce the students to the process, they are challenged to work in small groups to create a tower from spaghetti to hold up a marshmallow. The tallest tower wins. Students design products to be 3D printed. Ideas are prototyped and tested. 3D design software is used to create a file to be sent to the printer. Some final touches and it's ready for use. Robotics is another challenge for students. They learn the programming environment and about the hardware. They must then create and program a device to pick up an object, navigate around an obstacle, and drop it precisely on target. Egg drop packaging follows the same process. Students are limited in the supplies they can use. They then design, build, and test packages to cushion an egg as it is dropped. Some eggs are able to survive a drop of four meters. Students that would like to pursue a personal interest are welcome to use the resources in the Tech Ed room during ELT study hall. One student is a steam engine hobbyist and created a compressed air Lego engine and designed a dual valve sliding piston using the 3D printer. That was really cool. Each of these projects requires students to use their creativity and ingenuity to devise a solution for the problem at hand using the information, tools, and resources that are available, much the same way professionals attempt to solve problems today.